Hey y'all, what is up? It is your girl Michaela Lene and I am back with another video. And today's video is going to be another product review. And as you see, I am trying the Originals by Africans Best. So I want to say thank you to Curlbox for sending, sending me these products. And also thank you to me for spending my hard work and money on getting these products. So let's just hop right into the video. So there are very few products that pack the same punch for your buck as Africans Best. You know we're going to bring you the new and this box is no different. This new olive and aloe line off quality ingredients that get the job done. So the next clip you will see is me reviewing the shampoo. I will now be doing the olive oil and shea moisturizing shampoo. This moisturizing shampoo that goes beyond cleansing by reaching a high level of conditioning and hydration. And I can honestly say this shampoo, I was very disappointed in using this shampoo. As you can see now, it does give a good lather, but it's like I had to apply more and more shampoo just to get a really, really, really good lather. Like, you see, you see how it's like one side of the head is getting a really good lather and cleanse, but the other side is not really getting, you know, a really good lather. And I'm not liking that. Like, I shouldn't have to keep applying more and more, you know, shampoo just to get a good lather. Um, one thing I have started new in my routine is shampooing my hair twice. And you're going to see, um, where it's like the second time that I shampoo is when I'm really starting to get a good lather. And you, as you can see, I'm starting to get frustrated because of the fact I'm having to apply more and more shampoo and I shouldn't have to do that. And now this is the second time around that I'm shampooing. And as you see, and I'm getting more of a lather, lather than I did the first time because of the fact I took a lot more shampoo. But I shouldn't have to do that, you know. Like the first time around, it sort of kind of help you get the build up. And I shampoo my hair twice. That's why I know my scalp is good and clean. But I felt like my hair was really good and clean and getting more of my build up taken off the second time around than I did the first time. So, um, yeah, the shampoo was something I really didn't like. But as you can see, that's the shampoo. Now I'm about to talk about the conditioner. Now that I've finished shampooing, I'm moving on to my favorite part of the wash day routine, which is your deep conditioner. And I will be reviewing the hair mayonnaise deep conditioner and also will be applying the care and tea tree oil therapy. So a little bit about each product. The, the deep conditioner, this penetrating deep treatment is enriched with natural botanical herbal extracts, vitamins, egg protein, and olive oil to condition, moisturize, and strengthen damage or over-processed hair. And the care and tea tree oil therapy is a special blend of natural organic oils enriched with beta carotene, proteins, vitamins, and herbal extracts. This is an all-purpose oil. It's specifically formulated to rejuvenate hair, revitalize scalp, and nourish skin. So as you're seeing, I'm going ahead and pinning my hair up so I can go ahead and show y'all how I apply each of these products to one portion of my hair. So first things first, of course, you know, I'll be going in with the deep conditioner of course giving it a smell and it had a pretty good smell couldn't you know really complain about it so i take a really good amount a really 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 good amount and i make sure i work it in i'll work it in all over Yeah, make sure I work it in all over, even massage it into my scalp. Um, and then you're going to see where I go. Well, yeah, I go in for a little bit more. And you're going to see where I apply it to my ends. So keep in mind, your ends are the oldest parts of your hair. So you just want to make sure you work it 
all in. I know you probably see my lips moving, but I was having some music in the background. And so now, as you see, I'm going in with the carrot and tea tree oil. This is something that I learned by watching other YouTubers that they um, apply um, oil, you know, to their deep conditioner. This sort of kind of helps just add more moisture to your hair, especially with this being the winter time. And keep in mind, with us having naturally curly hair, our hair is prone to not being, you know, as moisturized during the winter time. So. You just got to do whatever it takes to try to keep your hair moisturized. And then I'm going to go in with my good old detangling brush. I'm telling y'all, that is definitely a staple to uh, my wash day routine. It really helps me get through, even though I could have finger detangled, but I was sort of kind of on crunch time doing this. So I was trying to get, you know, through the process. Now that I detangle my hair, the sort of kind of gliding my hands just to get any last minute um, tangles I didn't get. And now I'm going to sit there and just two strand it up so that's why I can move on to another section. Now that I have the deep conditioner applied to each section of my hair, I'm now going to go back in with the carrot tea tree oil and just apply all over my scalp. Um, again, I learned this trick from another YouTuber that I was watching and she, I saw that she applied um, a particular oil that she was using and I can really say it really did work wonders. Um, now that I apply the oil all over my hair, I'm now about to put my hair into a ponytail. And then I'm going to cover it up with my plastic cap. Yeah, now I'm taking my plastic cap. And I'm going to allow the deep conditioner to sit in my hair for about 5 to 10 minutes. Now that I allowed to sit in my hair, it's really been over, I want to say I had to do it the next day because the water was like freaking cold and I wasn't about to take no cold shower. So I let it sit in my hair overnight, but now that my hair, um, I'm ready to wash it out. Just y'all look at that one particular section. Just, just look at them curls. Just look like they just feel very, very moisturized. And so now I'm getting ready to rinse out. The deep conditioner and next i'll be going in with the leave-in the leave-in that i'll be using is the olive and shea leave-in conditioner this leave-in conditioner goes beyond conditioning by reaching a higher level of hair moisturizing strengthening and softening through the revitalizing formula helps to stop breakage restore shine and strengthen hair instantly excellent for all hair types including natural relaxed pressure texturized or color treated hair going back in a little bit more and what i'm going to do now is just split my hair into two sections just to make sure each strand of my hair is getting the leave-in conditioner um in my opinion it's best to apply your leave-in conditioner when your hair is fully fully wet that's the way um when you will put your i prefer y'all to do a t-shirt but if you have to do a towel your hair is still moisturized and it won't be as dry So just making sure that each strand of my hair gets that good moisturization from the leave-in conditioner. Y'all just look at the curls. Like, it's really given to the girls. Like, it's just given. Now I'm going to put my hair in a t-shirt and I will see y'all out of the shower. Alright, y'all. I am back. It is December 24th. So Christmas Eve. And I just finished washing my hair let me just give go ahead and give y'all a little recap 
So keep in mind, I was in the middle of washing my hair on last night. But um, that water was just a little cold, you know? If you leave the water running, it's gonna turn cold. It's not gonna stay that lukewarm you need it. It's just gonna turn cold. So that's exactly what happened. But this is my hair from, so <clears throat> I ended up having to keep the um, deep conditioner with the carrot oil in overnight. And I woke up around eight something this morning to wash it out. And this is what my results are looking like. And I absolutely do love it. And I did apply the leave-in conditioner, and that was pretty good. Give me one second because my they're right, having some lippity lip glow. Two styling products I will be using is the Olive and Clove Hair and Scalp Therapy. And a little bit about this product is this natural oil treatments help stop dryness, itching, and flaking, a unique natural conditioning formula that helps repair men and rebuild for healthy hair growth. Um, and then also, I'll be using the Olive and Aloe Moisturizing Growth Lotion. And a little bit else about this, this is a non-greasy formula, it's enriched with 100% pure olive oil, for ultimate hydration and a healthy dose of aloe vera to help repair your strands and seal in your nutrient-rich moisture. This product is ex is excellent for all hair types. <clears throat> so, nothing much has really changed. Just go ahead and put it up a little bit. Put it up and I'm gonna break it even further just to make sure that my hair is evenly getting it. While I'm doing this, I'm gonna just give y'all my honest opinion on the rest of the products I already use. The shampoo, I absolutely positively do not like. Um, because I have to use a lot just to get a good lather. Most importantly, um, you know, the first time I used it, my hair in my scalp did not feel clean. In my opinion, I really have to get a good lather just to, I want to make sure both my hair and my scalp are feeling clean and Honestly, um, using the shampoo the first time, I did not get that feeling. So when I went back in the second time, which I normally do anyway, that's something I have changed. Started going in. So this is what the oil ooh, is looking like. Oh, I'm making it. Okay. Um, and apply here. Make sure you massage it on the scalp area. Yeah, definitely, 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 definitely did not like. Now I'm going to go in with this growth lotion. <laughs> That's pretty good. And just apply it here. And it says it's supposed to have um, maximum strength. strength helps to treat dry hair and hold moisture. So I hope that is the case and scenario, especially with me using this as a wash and go. So we'll see. And then I'm gonna go in with my um, Tangle Teaser here. just to make sure the product has been evenly distributed to give me good curl definition. But we gonna see. But these are what the curls are looking like already. So, I'm gonna do the rest off camera um, and then I'll get back to y'all with my final results. 
so these are the end results i definitely definitely do like the way my um curls are looking and this is using the growth lotion and the oil um so if i had to give this line overall thing i can honestly say the shampoo really messed it up for them the shampoo i don't know what it was like for me to get a really good lather i had to take a lot and i don't want to do that like i shouldn't have to do that so i'm gonna give this line a seven and a half out of ten because the other product was pretty good i mean you know the deep conditioner i could really say it didn't really help my hair a lot so but um Other than that, you know, the shampoo won't really mess it up. But it's a pretty good product. I mean, um, a line in general. So I will have everything in the description box down below. It's the prices. Thank y'all so much for clicking in and tuning in to this video. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.